Hey YouTube viewers, this is uh, my 40 gallon planted tank which is dirted and I wanted to talk to you about CO2 and well there's basically four ways of getting CO2 in your tank uh, the first way is is by your fish, by your shrimps, by the bacteria which all produces CO2 however this level of CO2 that is produced by these creatures are is is good enough for a low light planted tank but if you wanted to boost your CO2 levels um, you may want to turn to let's say Flourish XL which is another way of boosting CO2 and well beyond um, these two first um, ways of getting CO2 in your planted tank is is this do-it-yourself CO2 setup and this setup is something um, you have to build yourself and learn as much about online which is and this CO2 setup is basically connected to this little filter here which pumps out bubbles of CO2 into the tank and all this and this method this do-it-yourself method has helped me get this result and well now I moved on to a stage where I felt that you know I wanted to try something more than these first three methods of getting CO2 in your tank and that is the pressurized CO2 system now I finally been able to afford this this pressurized CO2 setup and as you can see this I finally have this well this two and a half pound um, C um, CO2 tank I have your regulator here I have this um, bubble counter with a check valve and this therefore this tube this tubing is connected to another check valve um, just in case I guess and then it's connected to this um, CO2 reactor diffuser and it's a little it's a little complicated setup but I learn as much as I can online and well I gave it a test run to see if everything checks out and it seems to do pretty it seems to be doing all right but I haven't officially used it for a long period of time yet because I wanted to show you um, um, this video first before I actually officially start using it so I um, basically this is what I wanted to show you that you know there's four methods of getting your CO2 in your tank and as for me I moved on to a stage where I want to you know go beyond um, what I would have typically have done the past years of planted tank keeping and well I I hope the things will turn out all right as I you know you start using this pressurized system and well it's something that you have to really look into um, to learn about online as much as you can because it's not simply just pumping CO2 but you know there's like a whole science chemistry th things behind all of this CO2 using and lighting and substrates and nutrients it's, it's it's very interesting stuff well um this is all i want to show you and i thanks for watching